Welcome back. We've returned from our second um, visit to the Citadel. I apologize if I sound a little bit uh, stuffy in this video. I'm a little congested. Um, let's see what else we can do. We got both Garrus and Rex's um, personal mission and Technically, we also got Tali's, but that one does not show up in the journal. And, um... The mission... Uh, to get what she wants... Um, can be acquired by... Um... Hacking a terminal on Pharos, I think. So I don't really want to do that. Until I have the it that way. Other than that, all we have is Doctor at Risk. So not an awful lot of opportunity to mix things up compared to my Let's Play, where, you know, these are the three missions I did in addition to, uh, uh, after Novaria, in addition to UNC Cerberus. Uh, which we haven't heard about yet, even though we talked to Kohoku. Maybe because we got another message, and I'll have, I'll have to do something else first. Um, what we can actually do, though, since we finished Novaria, and this is one of those things that's really easy to miss, because, again, the galaxy map does not tell you where you've been. Uh, completing Novaria opens up Styx Theta on the, on the galaxy map. You can't go there before. And Styx Theta actually has two missions uh, in it that bo are both only random exploration, so you can't learn about them any other way. I'm gonna leave the Citadel first, of course. So I'm just gonna randomly do these. They're like among the last missions in the game I did originally. Because I remember them being kind of hard. But we've been seeking out the challenge, this Let's Play. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Shepard, this is Admiral Kohoku. I found out who set that trap for my men. The ones killed by the Thresher Moor. Damn, I hope you get this message. It was a group called Cerberus. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, highest level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments, trying to create some kind of super soldier. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. This is... This is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. I need to disappear before they find me. Okay, so you get um, that mission after going somewhere on the galaxy map, not when you open it. Fair enough. Our first mention of Cerberus. So, it's all downhill from here. Um, anyway. Uh, we're going to this place where there's nothing. At least not that we're told. But we'll find something soon enough. Um, even though I had Liara with me just previously, I kind of want to take her here again because facing Rachni on this mission and... So having a lot of biotic powers is going to be good to keep them off of us. Let's, um... Wait, this is a terrible combination. It's a great combination, don't get me wrong. Rex and Liara, awesome together. They both have great biotic powers and Rex is really strong too. But I need to have the tech, uh, capabilities. So I have to have either Garis, Tali, or Caden on my... 
um, team. So I guess we'll take Garrus. Actually, I'm going to take Caden um, instead. Because he does still have some biotic powers, which are more useful here. Sorry, Garrus. Alright, um, there is only one thing here, and it is a listening post. Alright, I remember the Rachni being somewhat of a challenge for the Mako even. Because of their asset, which is just very deadly. And I go around missing people, that's not great either. But we do get full XP for him now, so that part's nice. Because their acid bypasses shields, much like the Fresher Maw. So. gonna cause some trouble if it hits you, even in the Mako. Trouble that only Omnigel can solve. It's almost dead. How did it... Were they carrying cash? I just got 4,000 credits for killing that one. Um, probably need to upgrade some people. Neural Shock. I wonder if that works against... Um, Rachni. It does say Organic Enemy. It doesn't specify, so... Might as well. Put some points there. Um, let's give him Master Sabotage so we can unlock everything. There. That should be good. Liara, oh, does have uh, two points to assign. So yeah, lift and, and warp and uh, singularity. <laughs> That's really the only thing I'm interested in for her. And they're now maxed out. I don't have any points, right? No. Should also be getting the Paragon mission pretty soon, I think. Um, also, I have no idea what equipment Caden is using. Ah, uh, that's not too bad. No armor that, um,. He can wear. Fine, I'll do. Hmm. Just a dead guy. That did not work the way I wanted it to. I'm not going to make this. 
I remember in the original game, sometimes you can't and you have to use... Do it again, and you have to use Omnigel. I don't know if they got rid of that or if I'm just misremembering. These you kind of just have to get lucky. Incendiary around seven. I'll use those. And a Ryko 6 pistol. It's Ryko 7 pistol. Which it does not have. Um, I don't have any more mods to give him. Proton rounds are going to be useless here, actually. So, I'll give you cryo rounds. Or do you have polonium? Polonium's good. We have a three pistol squad here, but considering how powerful pistols are, it's not really a problem. Isn't it like all the, t the tiny dudes here? Yep. Ow. I'm gonna leave that aid station for on the way out. Oh, there are big guys. Um. This isn't the hard part. The hard part is the second mission in this chain. Not so much this one, from what I remember. Upgrade kit. Cry rounds. Oh, newer polonium rounds. So we can at least give those to Liara. There we go. Nothing else? Don't think so. And there's something on the right, so we're going left first. You know how this works, if you've ever watched my videos before. Ooh, wetware kit. Biotic amps. Nice. I'm... Oh, wow. I'll take that. That is a really good amp. Coming here paid off. And Liara can have the Polaris 7. And uh, I guess Caden can have the Prodigy 5 then. Sorry, Caden, you're bottom off the list. You can shoot these. I think it helps. Kinetic Stabilizer 7. We have some people who are short of uh, upgrades. We are too. Which, or she already has a Kinetic Stabilizer. Fine. Um, Caden can have that one then. And a bunch of weapons. And a bunch more weapons. I actually gave myself the sniper, the Spectre sniper, so even if we get one, that's not likely to be better. That does not mean, however. Nobody 
nobody has level 8 armor yet. Um, what is this noise? Mayday! 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 This is Lieutenant Marie Durand, 314th Infantry, Alliance 10th Frontier Division. The listening post has been overrun by unidentified hostile life forms. Request immediate extraction. Um, that's listening post Alpha, the uh, counterpart to this mission. I do believe you are still poisoned. Good job. Commander, you see this? They just received a supply run two days ago. The Rachni worked fast. Tell me about that supply ship. This planet is supposed to be uninhabited. The Rachni didn't come from nowhere. Hang on. Seems these things are drones, dispatched at irregular intervals from different depots to reduce the likelihood of tracking. Got it. It came from Argos Row. Wherever it is, there's probably more Rachni there. Let's get to the bottom of this. Very well, Shepard. Rachni infestation on Altehi seems to be the result of a supply drop from Argos Row. The logs downloaded from the freighter should allow you to backtrack the ship's course to its origin. Good. Well, that um, gives us a place to uh, to look. Um, why did it not show up in my missions then? That's the other listening post, but the Argos Row one did not uh, show up. Don't really know why. Maybe it shows up after you do the other mission too. Don't really know why. We learn about it here then. First time you play, you might be tempted to think that this is a result of releasing the Rachni Queen. Something is making a horrible buzzing sound here. Or humming sound. Which, of course, it isn't. And this mission is done, yes. Because this is another one of Cerberus's um, mishaps, I do believe. They have a lot of those. But yeah, let's go check out Listening Post Alpha. Still weird. Um, I'm also kind of confused because this still has an uh, exclamation point, not an X. Nothing else we can see on the map though, so I don't think there's any reason to look around further here. So let's scan the rest of this system. There it is. It's kind of just outside the uh, asteroid belt that sometimes happens. Tree insignia. Magnesium. And nothing. So, Erebus is where listening post Alpha is. If you don't go to Feta first, I think you get a distress call or something. If you go here... Um, I'm sticking with the same team, because we're facing the same enemy. I don't think I ever actually did these missions at all in my first playthrough because, yeah, this entire cluster has nothing in it that you can find out 
from elsewhere. You just have to notice that it suddenly appeared on your map and go there yourself. Um, well, my old notes say go to top right corner of map first. So I guess I'll do that. Must have had a reason. Discovery. It appears these particle bores were shut down after breaking through, t through into tunnels just below the surface. The shacks and equipment are stenciled with the logo of the Tenkara Mining Consortium, but there's no trace of the mining crew. And doesn't look like there's anything else here except for um, these things that I guess we, we can go into. Weapon upgrade and energized weave. Caden is still short of weapon upgrade, no? Yara is. Now you have two kinetic. Oh, Rachni Song. I don't think I've ever heard that out of the Mako. And a medical kit. Creepy sound. Let's move on. Well, now I don't need to worry about XP or anything. Actually, those, these don't give you XP, do they? No, they don't. Otherwise, this would be leveling up Paradise, this particular... Uh, ...mission. I feel like these guys are also easier to kill then most normal Ragnar. And yeah, the game uh, hung on me. First Lieutenant Durand, ma'am. Third Brigade, 14th Infantry Regiment. And I am damn glad to see you. We heard you needed some backup. Actually, we need to get the hell out of here. But I guess your ship couldn't carry us all. They dropped us here a few months back. We get supplies every couple weeks. We didn't see anything local that was more dangerous than lichen. Yesterday, these animals started coming out of the ground. No idea where they're from. This is what's left out of 90 men. I'm the ranking officer. We had 47 seconds before they showed up again, but they're, they're kind enough to wait for when you're talking. We do have a ship in orbit. We could bombard them. Wouldn't do much good. They're moving around deep underground. The only time they come near the surface, and they're right on our position. You bombard them. You take us out, too. Why are you out here in the first place? There's been a lot of pirate activity in this cluster. We set up a chain of listening posts in the local systems, in case they have a staging base. They're called Rachni. You get a supply ship in recently? Yeah, but that was an Alliance ship, Commander. I mean, it was a drone, running on automatics. But what- We've seen this before. It's a long story. What we just fought was a probe. Our seismic sensors are picking up a crap load more on their way up from underground. We've got five minutes, tops. We might be able to hold them off if we were at peak, but you can see the fighting's busted this place up. Do what you can to secure your position. We'll see if we can get some of your defenses operational. Aye, aye, Commander. You heard the woman. Everybody pool magazines and grenades. Take a leak and a drink while you can. And if anyone wants a smoke, it's as good a time as any. Um, I think you can just use the Mako, but I prefer to do this. Um, to connect the Mako to the generator, which... Uh, gives us the turrets. I 
Don't need Metagel. Uh, more rounds. Do I have time? Nine. Eight. There's nothing in here. Oh, wait. There was just a medical kit. Don't care. Um, you go there. You go there. And, um... I want to leave most of the... ...of my biotic powers for when I need them. Which may end up being never. Things are pretty fireproof. See, that's the... Actually, when I need them. Um, Liara, are you dying? You're dying, aren't you? Awesome. Um, Liara's dead, so I should probably revive her. And she should be using barrier. Caden's doing okay. How many of these guys are there? The answer is too many. That's not like we're on short supply of meta, you know? Alright, looks Area like we have an another swarm coming. How are those repairs coming? Um, well, I, I did it. I repaired. I say we get the hell out of here. I'm with you. Not much time left, Commander. Did I say that you could leave your spots? All right. Um, we have at least one more swarm. I like how our side is saying that now. Normally it's always the enemies that yell that at you. And here it is not. I don't know if... I will you! Yeah, I wanted to know if Neural Shock works against these guys. It does. Not very long, but it does work. Go, go, go! Too bad that these don't give you XP, because it would be a lot. I think I already said that. They're, it's kind of just faster to do this, uh, to like shoot them. 
than to bother with. Oh, I think that all missed. I think that all missed. Um, actually, no, I'm gonna bury her myself. I don't know, does Barrier even work against the Venom? Not entirely sure. Not really useful, but whatever. My recharge time is pretty good now. With the, uh, Improved... Um, uh, Biotic Amp that I got. Um, that didn't go well. Let's do this. You must die. Caden has lived too. I need to remember that. Can I sit down? Thanks. Almost done. Getting boring. ma'am. Talk about a near-run thing. You all right? Never mind me. Are you all right? Still on my feet. But we've been fighting for almost 26 hours straight. None of us will be standing for long. Ma'am, we're getting a signal from one of the ground scan UAVs. A big hollow space about 500 meters under the surface. Right. That must be it. That must be where they're coming from. My people aren't in any condition for a clearing operation, though. Just point us in the right direction. You don't have to do that, Commander. We've bled them. We can probably hold until a bigger ship arrives to get us off-world. If you want to take a throw at it, we'll give you the coordinates. But it's your call. You saved our asses, Commander. Thanks. Um... She's just glitching out. I'll destroy you! Calm down. Uh, there was Metagel there, and I did use some. Oh yeah, I need to disconnect a Mako, or just, well, I can't go in it. Alright, um, this is the mine, so I guess we'll go there next. Because it's closest. Ow. Um, the Mako... Alright. Mako was entirely stuck. This mission is, uh... 
glitchy. Anyway, it got itself unstuck somehow. Let's go deal with some Rachni. This is the part I'm worried about. Because this is the part I don't like. Too many... Too many Ragni in close quarters. And a strong likelihood of um, immediate squad made death. Which always does not bode well for me. So what we're going to be depending on a lot is this. Singularity. Can I shoot? Oh, damn. Where the hell did he come from? See, that already Area almost secured. went wrong. Um, at least you can save in between these encounters. Let's take them out. All patched up. Um, I did not do that. Why did you just use Metagel? I did not hit V. I'm gonna set a flag at the end of this mine because otherwise I'm gonna forget which way I'm going. I guess overload just hurt them a little. Ooh, great. All clear. With more stuff I don't need, but Hey, at least it's money. Clear. Wanna make sure that they're actually properly out of the Thing before I use my powers and we leveled up that is not surprising I got this last time and I forgot to put a point in it which hasn't hurt us yet but uh, now I definitely want to put a point in there Gotten all I want from her, really. Well, throw and warp are still useful, of course. Even if I don't use them that often. Perimeter clear. You kind of want to try and. They're to my right, aren't they? Of course. Why does that not surprise me? I 
Maybe I should set um, defensive powers automatic because I tend to forget. Yeah, I'm not bothering to use Unity. Metagel deployed. Kind of want to make sure that this is cleared out before I go in there because if it's not, then you know we'll get attacked from two sides, which is definitely not what we want. Um, let's try and lure them out slowly. If that's a thing that's possible. Oh. Somebody just got hit. Uh, it's not a thing that's possible. And Caden's dead. Do not know if that thing is susceptible to... to... Um, lift and stuff? I don't think it is. Why do I keep using Metagel when I don't want to? You're good to go. What the? Is my V key stuck? That's that the last one had my name on it. See, that was deliberate. It just keeps doing that. Now I only have one Metagel left. Well, at least I can replenish that on the Normandy. That wasn't too bad, though. Ooh, Gladiator 8 light armor. That's actually not that great. No, it's not at all. Uh... All right, one more to go. Actually, I'm going to use theirs first. In case they die, I still have my own. Medigel deployed. Oh, it keeps happening. That is not what I'm intending to do. Records of the Rachni War suggest bread warriors, the male gendered Rachni, only fight when a hive is severely pressed. It's safe to say you've eliminated the Rachni on Nepmos. Alright, um, that wasn't too bad. That's thanks to Biotics. And I ended up somehow using up all of my mana gel. I don't really know how that happened. Uh, I remember Volkov is decent? No.
Haven't gotten any of that. Didn't even need any grenades here. I was kind of expecting to, but... Kept things under control with the bionics, so... That, uh... Is fine. We're gonna go along the right wall, because I don't think I've been to this side. And there might be crates, like that one. Oh, another biotic amp. Not a very good one. No more Ragni? I guess after you kill the brute warriors that they don't come back. So I guess if you want max XP here, you should make sure you get all of them. Alright, we got a few things left to uh, mop up on this planet before we move on. Alright, um... Oh no, now I do have Depot Sigma, Sigma 23. That's good, because that's what I want to do next. But I do want to... Um, replenish my metagel, because I don't know what, hap what was happening there. I just kept using it. I can't use it on the Normandy to test... ...what was happening. Let's see what else is in this system. Doesn't look like there's any unknowns here. Um, some platinum. Prophean data disk. And that's it. So we want to go to Argos Row. To the um, Gorgon system. What's in Hydra? Ah, that was... Uh, UNC the stress call. We've been there. There's Gorgon for um, the depot. And Phoenix is Rex's family armor, so we'll do that next. Since we're here anyway. the ship here. No planet to drive on. Nothing to scan so far. Alright, um... Let's go with, um... Garrus and Ashley for variation. Hopefully their, their abilities aren't great for Rachni, but they should be okay. Oh, we don't have any new heavy armor. Probably do have some nice new uh, assault rifles there. Polonium route. Wait. 
prior rounds. Um, kinetic stabilizer. And I... Oh, wait. I should be using the upgraded combat scanner. And for Ashley, it's kind of pointless. But whatever. Garrus, you have an Equalizer 7, which... Uh, oh, a Volkov 7 is better. And sure, why not? Um, got some armor. Not useful, though. There's Weave 7 and... A blade of coating seven. Energized weave seven. Sure. I always have him use um, sniper rifles anyway, which in here is kind of pointless, I guess. But it doesn't really matter for Garrus so much. This is a fight your way out mission, isn't it? We're gonna have to deal with the small guys on the way in and then... Big guys on the way out. Oh, nice shot. And they add some crates on your way out, which I think are not here yet. They only show up after you are done with um, the mission, I think. Ooh. New biotic amps, but I doubt they're better than mine. I'm right. Ooh, medic uh, that's a pretty good medical interface, and an Omni 2, which Garrus might be able to use. That's a good one. Um, neither Ashley nor Shepard needs a medical interface, uh, nor Garrus needs a medical interface, and I have a better one. We will save it for our other squad mates. And as is custom, we will go to the place with the exclamation point last. Especially in this mission where I think you'll be on a timer once you enable the self-destruct. Krogan heavy armor, human medium armor. I, Ashley is using heavy armor, I think. Medium armor can sometimes be better, though. Um, what rounds are... She's using cryo. Garrus is using tungsten, which is synthetics, which is not... useful here. You can do... Oh wait, that's actually the wrong gun. Also using cryo. Let's make him shatter, for at least for this mission, that should be good. Why do I feel I got worse at this? More weapons. That seems to be it. And nothing else. Personal data recorder for Major Elena Flores. 
Play the first entry. Sigma-23 is almost fully operational. The barracks and storage lockers are complete, and we've begun stocking the munitions. It's highly unlikely the Alliance will patrol in the nebula. I expect our only risk will be from pirates, and who will believe them? Looks like we'll have space for two reinforced platoons of Cerberus commandos. Cerberus? Is that a corporation? Cerberus again. We haven't done their mission yet. Is the dialogue different if you have? I'm not sure. Play the second entry. The package arrived today for field testing. I'm told they're fundamentally similar to the units being developed on Novaria. They promised this batch would be stable. Something about them developing in proximity to the master control unit. We detected some pirates setting up an anchorage in a neighboring system. I think we'll try deploying them there first. Play the last entry. They've escaped containment. Clever bastards. We treated them like animals. We should have treated them like POWs. They're spreading. Boarding the supply ships and sending them to random destinations. They'll be all over the cluster in a week. General, if you recover this message, my advice is... Screw the Rachni. They're too smart. Use one of the other projects. Flores, signing off. For the final time. Another batch of experimental Rachni get loose. These things need warning labels. Indeed, they do. And don't worry, I'm sure it's another rogue cell of Cerberus. Elusive man had nothing to do with this. I think Cerberus consists entirely of rogue cells. Let's go. Uh, the escaped Rachni definitely came from this station, though the motives behind this Cerberus group are vague. To prevent further contamination, arm the station scuttle charges and evacuate to the Normandy. Knew it. Um, there's nothing in here, right? No crates, no. And we have a minute to get out. I'm um, okay. Somebody had a bad time. Okay. I didn't even see that coming. Personal data recorder for Major Elena Flores. Play the do this. Highly looks like we'll have. Play the, the second. Package. They promised that we detected some pirates setting up an. Play they the last. spreading, General. I think I did because there was no reaction from Ashley, so. Um Yeah, sure, sniper that guy. Let's see, now we got locked crates, but at least the time doesn't move while you're doing this. And I have a reasonable idea of how to get out of here. deal with inventory and stuff after we're out of here. All right, I think we made it. Cutting it pretty close. But we did it. Okay, um, well like I said, since we're here, we might as well go do Rex Family Armor, because that is in uh, the same cluster, somewhere in the Argos Row cluster, doesn't even tell you where. But I know where it is, of course.
Um, didn't look at all the plans yet here, but since the dot is gone, I'm hoping I didn't miss any. Because I don't know what orbit it was in. Well, nothing in, on any planet in this system. Um, Hydra is where we need to be. No, it's not. Hydra is where we've been. Phoenix is where we need to be. Isn't this like also where Pinnacle Station is? If you have that, um, DLC, which of course is not available for the Legendary Edition. Profane Data Disk. All out of nothing. And Tuntau. Of course, you gotta bring Rex on this mission. And, um. Do Tali. Um, let's check if I have any... Did I get any better inventory? I'm all messing around. I don't think so. Rex, um... Armageddon has way better DPS, so... And again, I don't have any weapon upgrades to give him. Um, I've got some better amps. And I've got some better... armor. I think I might like this better. Um... Yeah, we'll go with this one. Medic Butter 7 and... Energize Weave. Tali, you have uh, Medical Interface 5. You can, I guess we can upgrade that to a 6. And Energized Weave. Am I like the only person who does not have... Uh, two slots here? Uh, but this is not good enough. Tali is using a Spectre shotgun. That's right, I gave one to her. Don't really know what we're facing here, so... Switch to cryo rounds, and I don't have any other weapon upgrades. Um, hidden structure, I guess, is our first destination. Oh, that was easy. Couldn't get out the Mako because I was still moving slightly. Do not remember what we face here. But this is the place. My armor's here somewhere. I guess you can sense it. Sure. It'll probably be a clusterfuck because these missions always are. As long as they don't flank us too much, uh, we should be fine.
and don't try to rush us like this dude. Like seriously, what was your plan here? Did he die? No, he's just flying. Um, he's still alive, which is very annoying. And we have another rusher. Actus himself. So we're doing this in an annoying way because I can't finish any of them. Lost shields. Um. Let's lift him. Rex doesn't have lift, does he? No, it's kind of annoying. Is he dead? I am not sure. Right. Um. That was a what? You're still alive? How is that possible? You're annoying me, sir. All right. Now he's dead. Now we gotta take out the rest of these dudes. I can't shoot because you're in my way. Um, his shield's restored while he was... These guys have good shields. That was probably not the smartest way of doing that. But who cares? Uh, that's the problem. They keep going out of sight and then I can't kill them. Pirate Sniper. All right. Oh. There's a sniper up there. Two can play that game. Assuming you ever come out. And the answer is he does not want to come out. Fine! We'll deal with your friend first. Come on, dude. There we go. Now we just have that sniper that's up there. I'll go upstairs first, why not?
He shouldn't be too much of an issue. Looking for stuff. Oh, I could have blown these up, probably. To, I don't know if that would have taken the sniper out, though, because he was kind of more on this side. I don't think anybody else was up here. Weapon and armor upgrades. Ammo upgrades. Oh wow. I got a lot of stuff just from um I don't really wanna have want you to have two of the same but the same story is true for Tolly, so it doesn't really matter. Um this is it. I can't believe my ancestors ever wore this piece of crap, but at least I've got it back. I'm glad we could help you get it back. I might just be starting to like you, Shepard. Rex touches his grandfather's armor, his expression thoughtful, perhaps? Krogan are hard to read. Then he shakes off his bemusement and grips his gun with renewed port purpose. Time to move on. It's almost getting sentimental there. Um, uh, way too many ammo upgrades and more biotic amps. Now we're suddenly just getting a lot of those. Savant seven is pretty good. Might be better than what Rex has. It is. Some Omni tools would be nice. Because Charlie can use those. I didn't get any, did I? No, just a blue wire tool 5, which isn't that great. Let's check back here. That is all I don't need. Wait, did I actually... No, I didn't. I forgot to upgrade everybody. Um, warp and... Barrier, sure. Who told you had a lot of points? Actually. Um... Rex does not have first aid, so for the sake of this particular combination of teammates, probably not a bad idea to give Tali some first aid points. Alright, quite a lot of stuff in this mission. That's good, I like stuff. That's it for Rex's family armor, and we'll continue in the next video.